Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I have been quite busy between work, managing my pain. I am moving my camera around. I apologize. Um, life has just been like complete. Life has just been crazy. I'm sorry, a phone call came in. Um, and yeah, so... And then we also have a uh, family member in ICU. Um, they are doing better, but they had a blood clot go to the heart and it's just been like crazy. I have not been able to go see them because they live uh, about an hour and a half away and I have work. And then when I'm not working, I am recovering from work um, and cooking and cleaning and taking care of the home front as well. But I really, really want to get on here, you guys, and say, for one, I've not forgotten to ship to the two winners. Um, so I will probably ship. I might ship this weekend, but I don't know because I work a lot this week due to Thanksgiving. I do work on Thanksgiving, by the way. Um, so signing up for this job during the holiday season, I knew that was going to probably happen. Um, so I, I am going to ship, I have them in bags, um, ASAP. On that note, I have a great, great holiday giveaway that will come up really soon. So stay tuned, um, for that. I have been putting things away for months for that. And I have a really big surprise. Um, also I am trying to wear all natural makeup working in there at Disneyland. Um, they don't allow any bold, bright colors, no wing liner. Um, so I, I am trying to tone it down. When I bring out a color for the palette, I want, I want color. So I have to bring out like neutral. Anyways, enough talking. I had to come on here and show you this. When I saw this collab come out, with those two colors and Mickey for his 90th birthday, which is November 18th. I believe I worked that day. I'm super excited. Um, I'll let you know if they do anything special or if we get a pin or anything for it. Super excited. So here it is. I did not buy the whole thing, but I bought most. I bought a palette, two lip glosses, and two uh, lipsticks so the palette came in this cute packaging and then here is the palette it is cardboard I was hoping it would be more metal but it is cardboard and then on the back it shows you you get six shades and one highlighter so let's see if it says anything on here oh and they included stickers I just saw that that was too cute so now this is a thank you card anyway so you have um six eyeshadows 0.4 ounces 1.2 grams one highlighter 0.28 ounces 8.0 grams vegan it points out that it is vegan it has a small mirror and then here are the shadows i will swatch these very briefly I'll do them right here. That's one swipe. Then we're gonna go to the next row, which are, the, so it looks like two shimmers and four mattes, which I use today. So those are the six shades and then there's one highlighter. Right here. Beautiful highlighter, if you can see that, it's so great. I'm wearing it today. So I am wearing, um, let the show begin, um, hug me, hooray, ah, uh, shucks, they have cute names. M is for mischief, and oh boy, and then beyond classic. So I am wearing oh boy and hug me. I'm wearing these two right here. Um, I definitely wanted to dip into the other ones, but again, I have to be very, very neutral at work. Um, so, but I will get some use out of this. 
All I can say is it is a first impression. The mats blended out absolutely seamlessly. They went on without any problems, no patchiness. Um, and I, I mean, come on, you guys knew I was gonna buy this uh, Mickey collab. Super, super cute. I just wish the packaging was a little more uh, heftier filling, you know. There we go, because it was a little on the pricey side. It was uh, $39, so, you know, it's almost 40 bucks for a palette. You can get, you know, much bigger palettes, but I am happy with it. And then I got two of the lipsticks. Here are the little, so, so cute. And then I got the color Forever in 1928, which is the year I believe uh, he was born. Could be wrong, but I'm just guessing. Um, so here's the color Forever. I am wearing one of them. I'm wearing this one. It had a Mickey head right here, but it's gone. I used it once and it is gone. The only thing I will say, I'll say these are absolutely creamy. I'm not sure if they're meant to be matte. Let's see if it says matte on here. No, it is a satin lipstick. So they are both satin. Uh, very creamy. Went on absolutely perfect i do like how it is like shaped you know tilted but i worry that it is so far up that i'm gonna break it so i want to put it on it was very light it is a twist up um but it won't go down anymore this is where the standard is i guess and then it has the little mickey ears so i will take that to work with me here it is 1928 and now you can see the Mickey ears because I have not used it. Um, beautiful color. The uh, There was a third one and it was much darker. And um, this would be good with a lip liner. But again, once you use it, the Mickey goes away. But it is carried on the packaging. I love it. Super happy with these. My lips have been so dry lately, you guys. I've had to stay away from mattes. I've re Reverted back to cream, velvet, and gloss. Because this weather, I love, but it is just uh, horrible on the body. So I got the lip gloss in one and only. I am wearing it. This is the packaging again. I'll probably keep some of these, maybe one of each. I don't need all of them. Um, they smell like vanilla cake so good this i am wearing over this one it like goes over it like perfect uh very very creamy i probably won't take that to work so i'm not gonna apply both but um i am usually not a big lip gloss fan but this carries color and i absolutely love it so that is one and only and then this one is muha wow if I'm saying that right. Um, I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh. Just stunning. It is gorgeous. I did not need another lip gloss, mind you. But these were um, $17 for lipsticks and lip glosses. But this is just beautiful. Very sheer. But it is just, I hope you can see the glitter specks and they're so pretty so anyways i love this now last time i looked they were sold out of the palette but they did have all of the lipsticks in so i have to say um and then they have the mickey on the box i'll probably keep that box it's just too cute uh, i am super happy with the set dose of colors usually never ever lets me down they're really really good and um just a phenomenal brand and then I've had this for quite a while. Um, this is the Kylie lip gloss set. It is her new lip glosses. Uh, she sends this. I love the light pink. It's really pretty. Good choice. Love these products you picked. I hope you enjoy them as much as I do. Uh, and then, of course, these are printed, not actually autographed. So...
Okay, we'll put it on and I'll turn it on. So I did, I ordered the bundle. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven lip glosses. And I have been using these. I ordered these. So I got, okay, I ordered these the day they came out. I ordered the bundle. I think it was $87 for the bundle. I'm so unfair, right? Uh, it doesn't say how much the bundle was, but I got the bundle. Anyways, I don't know what it is with me and lip glosses lately. Again, my lips are dry, so I'm, I was very curious. She said this is a new formula, so I'm like, okay. I ordered the bundle, and I literally had the package within three days. I was mind blown. Uh, her shipping was phenomenal on these, so I got to give her props uh, big time. I've been getting a lot of use out of them. I've been taking, I've been taking them to work and using them. Um, and then I used them yesterday too. So we'll go through them real quick. We have, oh, you fancy. So let me get that one out. So beautiful and swatch it. These are super, super creamy. This is more of a sheer one and it has specks of glitter absolutely love this packaging and i absolutely love how it feels on the lips there's no tackiness these are 0.11 ounces um beautiful absolutely beautiful then the next one is snatched this one oh my gosh this is so far my favorite i wore this yesterday and it packs some color with it it is almost like a velvet, not a lip gloss. It is so stunning. And it carries color for quite a while. I, I was very surprised when I wore this and how much color it carried for quite a while. I am so, so happy with that. Then we have Diva. This is beautiful. Such a neutral toned down color um and again it is more like a velvet i am surprised at how much color they carry because typically with a gloss once you put it on after a few minutes the color is just gone and you're left with a gloss these uh the first one does go pretty sheer but snatched it packs some color and it holds it daddy's girl that is gorgeous look at the shimmer in there um this will probably be pretty sheer i'm gonna guess i'm gonna swatch it on this hand because my other hand has a bunch but that is beautiful so maybe that on top of or if you just want a little bit of gloss on you know, beautiful. I love the pink shimmer in that. And then we have three more. Yes, girl. Ooh, that almost looks like the one from Dose of Colors. The moi. <laughs> um, see if they smell. Just a little bit like they smell like her lipsticks. If you have her lipsticks, um, they are not tacky at all i mean when i swatch it on it feels like it's gonna be tacky but it is not um i i have to say this is a different formula than a regular gloss it carries a thicker formula but not tacky and it lasts longer then we have always shining Ooh, that is super pretty Oh my gosh, we're, we're just going to keep switching hands here. That is beautiful. That looks like a um, icicles. Ooh, so pretty. So again, that one's going to wind up being sheer. I'm pretty sure maybe a lip topper or if you just want a bit of glitter on your lips. It's great. Last but not least is clear with a K. Oh, look at that. This looks like a um, bubble bath. That's what it reminds me of. 
watch the formula as I bring it out. It's like thicker than a regular gloss. Just gorgeous. Again, this one's going to be probably sheer. Uh, but anyways, so I am super, super happy with these glosses. I am very, I was very hesitant buying them, but I am very glad I bought them. And my favorite one is Snatch. It is gorgeous. I love this one. If you're going to buy one, I would highly, highly recommend that one because it is stunning and it carries some color. So um, this is a long video, you guys. I'm sorry. I'm trying to fit in as much as I can. Last but not least is, yes, I went to Morphe the other day with my friend and I got the James Charles palette. I was not going to buy this because I have a lot of color palettes. Um, you do get the Trend Mood discount there. Here is the palette. I absolutely love how he has his name here. It changes it up kind of like um, the Jaclyn Hill palette. She changed it up and made it like silver in her name. Um, I couldn't resist when I walked in and I saw all these colors. I'm like, oh my gosh. Um, I have used, I use these two today and that one in the corner of my eye. So I can't give an opinion on these. If you guys want a tutorial or you just want me to come back on here with my opinion later, after I've gotten use out of this and more use out of Dose of Colors, let me know and I will do a tutorial or either or both. I will definitely come back on with my monthly favorites. My heck yeah, so, so, hell no. But so far, this I can say is really, really good. Um, this, I can say these blended out perfect. This was a perfect shade for all over. This is a perfect shade for the crease. But again, I want to come back and like totally use, you know, these shimmers and bold colors. Because you know me, I love my colors. So it does have the names on the slider. But good Lord, I don't know why they couldn't have printed them right down below. They have plenty of room. And this was $39. And I think that was a little up there for uh, Morphe. So I looked at the Jaclyn Hill palette, and that one I think was 38 So he was a dollar more. I know you get a lot of color. I know that. But put the names on the palette, for goodness sake. Um, so this is Artistry palette. I love, love, love the packaging. I cannot throw that away. On the back, it says, Hi, sisters. James Charles here, and welcome back to my palette. I love glam, but I also have a huge passion for crazy, colorful, outside-of-the-box makeup. And I created this palette with that in mind. I included every beautifully formulated shade necessary to create literally any look you could possibly imagine. I can't wait to see what you come up with when you unleash your inner artist. And that is hashtag Morphe Times James Charles. So in the palette, you get 39 shades, and I'm looking for the uh, grams, ounces, what have you. There is Red Lake in some of them. Mind you, um, when you see Red Lake uh, 7, I believe that carries uh, the same thing Jeffree Star palette had, where it can stain your eyelid for a little while. I never had that problem. Um, just going over the ingredients briefly. Uh, it, so I would look at the ingredients before you buy this. Um, I am not worried about it. If it does that, then I just clean my eyelids again and then go over it. Uh, so net weight is 75.7 grams, 2.67 ounces. You get a lot. You get a ton of product in here, you guys. But you can always see, you already see my fingerprints looks greasy. I don't know why, but I am super, super excited to dig in here on my day off. Uh, it's just gorgeous. So yeah, I, I will be back with this, you guys. I will be back, but I do, uh, I love to support other YouTubers and I have to say congratulations to James Charles. 
uh, for getting that collab. Phenomenal, amazing, and I have a feeling I'm going to love the palette, but I can't say I do yet. And then while I was there, I picked up the uh, Jeffree Star. They had very, very little of his holiday collection, but they had a couple of lip scrubs. So I got the eggnog. Um, so I'm having an issue with my order from Beautylish. They are saying they do not have his lip ammunition in stock and nobody does. That is what they sent me today because my order was supposed to ship today. So I don't know when I'm going to get my order. I'm a little frustrated. I wish companies would not sell something if they don't have it. And if they don't have it, make it a pre-order. Um, I did not order Dominique Cosmetics because she comes out and says it's a pre-order. I was all set to order and I just, I don't want, if I'm going to order, I want my stuff now. Unless I've prepared myself to wait on it. I'm going to wait for hers to go to Sephora. However, I did order the Laura Lee holiday set because if you look at her palette, screams Christmas. She's got red and green and silver. Oh my gosh, it is beautiful. She has highlighters, lipsticks. Again, I do not get involved with the drama. So if you don't like Laura Lee or whatever, for whatever reason, when I do that um, video, you just don't have to watch. But it caught my eye and I'm trying really hard to do the low buy. Really, really hard. So Anyways, holiday giveaway, I, I'm i telling you, there's a big, big surprise in that. I, I'm so excited, you guys. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Make sure you are subscribed and you give me a thumbs up if you like my video. And um, that is pretty much all you have to do. And I love the comments below. If I don't get back to you, it is not intentional. Um, I would love comments, though. That would be great. Heart monitor is still on, going, going good, irritating my skin, and kind of breaking out with a rash. So I moved it yesterday, but it's there. We're going good two weeks into it. So I'm so sorry, you guys. It's been so long, but I hope you guys have an absolutely wonderful weekend and Thanksgiving that is coming up. I will try to be back on here again. I am super busy, but I love my channel and I will not be completely gone. So uh, I will see you soon. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.